All right, guys, let's talk about something that I'm hearing a lot of comments about, and that is low-carb food or keto food or carnivore food, and always usually that term is followed by friendly, uh, and also along with that would go the term net carbs. And so what is my take on keto-friendly, carb-friendly, low-carb or net carb food? And it comes down to a couple of really simple things. Number one, it doesn't matter. A carb is a carb. There is no such thing as a net carb. A carb is a carb. So however many carbs the food that you're eating has in it, that's how many carbs it has in it. That is the rule of thumb to live by. Anything else is advertising. When you're talking about carb-friendly or keto-friendly, it's as simple as looking at the ingredients. It doesn't have one ingredient. Because it is not carb friendly, or excuse me, it is not keto friendly, it is not carnivore friendly, if it has more than one ingredient. Because both of those diets consist of single ingredient foods. Now, we all know that I will put uh, sugar free artificial sweeteners in my water, 100%. I absolutely do it. And it's made of some sort of chemical that I can't, I can't pronounce. Um, I don't do it. Um, as a, on a regular basis, and I don't do it, uh, or I don't do it on a regular basis, but also I will do it as I want to. That's not food that I eat necessarily, though, and it doesn't come in any massive quantity, but I absolutely do it. But I would never eat something as a good, that's all carb free, obviously. I would never eat something that says keto friendly or, uh, you know, keto bread or keto. Ice cream or keto. Uh, what else do they have? Uh, they got keto candy. All of these things. It's all crap. You shouldn't eat it. It's all made of chemicals. I've had uh, one of my favorite things, and I just absolutely love it. I think it's made by Cadbury. It's a sugar-free candy, chocolate candy with caramel, and it tastes to me like uh, a regular chocolate caramel. I don't understand how they're getting it sugar-free. Uh, clearly some sort of chemical agent at work there, clearly some sort of ingredient that I'm not going to be able to pronounce goes into making that delicious thing, and I will eat a hundred of those things. Uh, so have I had them? Yes. Uh, have I had them as a treat every few months? Yes. Do I eat them in any kind of with any kind of regularity? No. So I would encourage you all to do the same. If it is not a single ingredient, it is not, uh, for the most part, keto or carnivore. Certainly, you've got a couple of things. You can eat cheese, as an example. But generally speaking, the rule of thumb is, if it says friendly on it, it ain't. And you shouldn't be eating it. Opportunities are everywhere. you got to go get them. Start by going for a walk, huh?